What do you think of when you imagine the heart of a community? What do you see? What do you hear? What do you feel? What do you smell? It is through our senses and at a walking speed that we best experience a place. So in West Vancouver residents overwhelmingly identify the intersection of 15th and Marine Drive as the heart of their historic town center, Ambleside, we endeavor to redesign what is currently an unwelcoming place for pedestrians into a true community heart. Currently, the intersection is occupied by two gas stations, a temporary showroom for development outside of Ambleside, and a subway restaurant. Vehicles en route to other parts of the region exit Highway 1 onto 15th Street, resulting in heavy traffic flow through the site. These conditions allow the car to dominate, which degrades the pedestrian realm and is counter to what residents want. They told us they wanted reduced traffic, support of sl small local businesses, more housing options, and a more walkable, welcoming street streetscape, as well as better access to transit. Despite these negatives, the site has Ambleside's greatest assets, such as public views and access to the water. In addition, the site's bus stops see the highest number of onboarding passengers in Ambleside, making the site the main arrival and departure point for transit users. So knowing that Ambleside is dominated by the car, has fragmented pedestrian connectivity, and is unable to meet housing needs, the studio team then asked, how can we take advantage of the site's assets to design a formalized community heart that can address these issues? We conducted an urban design analysis, engaged the community, and took lessons from vibrant places around the world to develop three guiding principles for a successful heart in Ambleside. First, we envision a well-connected Ambleside. This means Ambleside should provide strong transit and pedestrian connections to services, amenities, and commercial areas. Second, we envision a diverse Ambleside. Diversity re refers to the economic and demographic diversity, but also the variety of activities that happen in the public realm. Third, we envision an appealing public realm, which has the ability to engender human emotion, create memorable experiences, and foster a community identity. Guided by these three principles, the studio team developed a conceptual design proposal for the heart of Ambleside that drives the transition from a car-centric intersection to a place for people. Stuart will now introduce you to our proposed designs. Thank you, Devin. 15th Street will now become the main pedestrian route to the water. This connection is enhanced through streetscape improvements, such as widening the sidewalks and adding rest areas along the way to mitigate the effects of the area's steep topography, especially for the senior population. The sites of the two gas stations at 15th and Marine will be rezoned to encourage their redevelopment into mixed-use buildings with commercial storefronts at grade and residential units above that follow family and senior-friendly design guidelines. The redevelopment will also include two new public plazas on the corners of both sites that will accommodate B-line bus stops that are connecting the heart with the region. Seating and wayfinding features at these stops will make for a more comfortable and easy to use transit experience. These plazas will also be destinations in and of themselves. Landscaping and public art installations will define the plazas as outdoor rooms and reinforce the heart's unique identity. The plaza's designs will encourage a variety of pedestrian-oriented activities, such as waiting for transit, social interaction, and community ac com commercial activity. The permission of outdoor patio seating will activate the building frontages, allowing the commercial activity of the new developments to spill out onto the plazas. Connections to the water are further strengthened south of Marine Drive by deprioritizing the car and prioritizing the pedestrian. The closure of the 15th and Argyle intersection to vehicles will reroute traffic onto 14th and 16th streets in order to maintain vehicular access to the waterfront while improving access for pedestrians. Street trees will frame the views south, helping reconnect Ambleside with its greatest natural asset, the ocean. Finally, the street right of way will be reconceptualized with public art serving as a landmark and helping signalize that this is now a place for people. So what should you imagine for the future heart of Ambleside? The sound of conversation coming from the crowded patios on the new plazas, the feel of a comfortable bench as you wait for the Beeline bus, the smell of fresh
fresh air and unique food offerings coming from the locally owned restaurants and the sight of the ocean that draws you down 15th from your West Vancouver home to the new heart of Ambleside Town Centre. Thank you.